Firstly, I love the colours and I love um, even the handles. I think that just these tiny details can make such a difference to a design. Hi, I'm Lucy Watson and I'm probably best known for being an influencer, author and animal activist. So my partner and I bought this house um, a year ago and we always knew that we wanted it to be a project and we wanted to redo our kitchen specifically and extend the house so that we could have a bigger space. Obviously I knew about Wren um, when I went into this process just from seeing in design magazines, um, kitchen magazines, um, social media, all those kind of things. I did meet with a few companies but Wren seemed like the best fit for me. I found the experience with the showroom really exciting. Um, the showroom was really big, it had so many different kitchen inspirations um, and ideas. I knew I wanted to avoid a modern kitchen because of my house being old and I'd seen Shaker style kitchens and they had different options for Shaker style kitchens which I thought was really cool. The Shaker that I went for was a little bit sort of less traditional because I wanted to add in those Scandinavian industrial themes as well. I think I just tried to mix little bits and bobs here and there. I didn't ever want to stick to one entire theme for the design. I really took a while to fully decide exactly what I wanted um, but with the kind of way that Wren does all their designs and they show you everything mocked up it's really easy to imagine what it's going to look like and, and come to that final decision. I had so many different things I wanted to include in the kitchen I didn't think I was going to be able to include everything an island was like a goal of mine because I just always wanted to a kitchen with that element. In terms of appliances it's they weren't really something that I'd thought about much because I think when you think about doing a kitchen you think about the design more at the forefront of your mind and what it's going to look like rather than the details but when we got in there and spoke with the team they obviously went through all the different appliances that um, could be provided. They taught me through all the different features of everything, um, things that I hadn't even thought of like having um, a six ring hob which is just so good for someone that's always cooking like me and having the sink in the island I actually really like, I just think the sink is actually cool in itself, I get so many compliments about it anyway. Because of the space that we have, we ended up having this sort of extra area of units and um, I kind of envisioned that it would be a little area where we made drinks when we had people around for dinner and things like that and having a wine fridge just seemed like a really nice touch. It was something that I did want um, and we talked through different sizes and what it's going to look like and we managed to get quite a slim one so we could put more storage either side and storage is so important to me that um, yeah, it was a perfect fit. It was quite a quick turnaround and once the design had been finished, I think that day I actually said I would like this to be delivered within two weeks and I knew it was ambitious but I'd been not living in my house for three months and I wanted to move in as soon as possible. That was met and they managed to get the first phase of the kitchen installed on the date that they had promised. We even had to move it around a little bit I think because the floor hadn't arrived and things like that and they were super helpful. I love the tap as well, which was actually provided by Wren. We looked around for taps that we thought would fit in terms of style, in terms of material, for a really long time. We ended up going with the one from Wren because it had the filter tap and the hot water tap, which I've never had before. And it just, it's just saves having a kettle, it's saving me having to buy bottled water, which is better for the environment. And um, it's, I use it every single day. It's one of the best things, one of the best features of the kitchen for sure. We didn't know we were going to do this initially but we ended up making it into a full-on kitchen dining living area which is just, it just means that we spend pretty much all of our time in here, even just in the evenings we sit down and watch TV or like for our dining area we have friends and family round and it's really sociable, um, really cosy as well and everything's nicely spaced out. I mean we kind of went with it as we went along through the process and it turned out even better than we had expected.